What's going on everybody and welcome back to another my video video where today we are going to be talking about the special announcement that I teased at pretty much a month ago and if some of you don't or didn't understand what the teaser was about well I have teased it in my laser tag video and my 100 subscribers special video that is right we are going to be talking about the Matty VR movie <laughs> If you don't know what I'm talking about or what this Matty VR movie is, let me explain. So in the year of 2022, I thought of an idea that when I hit a certain sub goal, I would have released a channel movie. The thing was, is that a movie takes time and it's supposed to be an hour long. So my idea was that I was going to record it early so when the time came, just a few days later and boom, the movie comes out. So, when making a movie or a film, you have to create a plot that will make sense. If you make a movie that literally has less of an IQ of a shampoo bottle, then no one will watch it. That's why with so many brain cells and so many chromosomes went to waste, I thought of this plot. Spoiler alert, this is not actually the script for the final project, this is only the early test. So, the script goes, the movie begins with shots in the rec centre, then it fades into Matty's room, where he's editing a video, when he gets a message welcoming him to, re to rec con, I can't read, Matty decides to accept the offer and goes the next day. Alright, now strap in, because this one's going to be longer. When he makes it to the event, he goes to the bathroom. While he's, while he's in there, a mysterious figure busts through the wall and kidnaps all the other YouTubers at the main hall. Matavia comes out and spots the mysterious person until running away. At home, at home, May realises that the... YouTubers from Retcon have been kidnapped. Matty feels confused and anxious about the fact that this may be his fault. And now, what was the actual plot? Well, there was any. Now, the original plot for the film was that YouTubers got kidnapped and then Matty felt bad about it because apparently it was his fault. So... He went on a big adventure to stop the person to whoever did this. And guess who was at the end uncovered? Yes, it was Mr. Orange. And his plot armory was that he wanted to be a bigger part of uh, Rec Room. So he kidnapped all the YouTubers. So yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. But now I thought of this, right? What made him feel like it was his fault nothing really came from him or anyone right like i didn't understand it until i finally just wanted to change the scripting now i did manage to get the script done for this movie now this is going to be the official thing so i'm only going to tell you a little snippet so Matty VR starts from a young age, showing him how at school he got bullied for not having a channel. He then makes one, he gets, uh, he's impressing all these bullies and all the people in his class. He graduates uh, middle school, high school, and this is all I can say. Because if I say anything else, spoilery forever. Wait, hold on a second. You thought this was the end of the announcement? Tuh! <laughs> I think you're dreaming. Do you know who you're talking to? We got a lot more than just script changing. We got production, actor roles, and even opportunities to be in the movie. So, let's talk about its actual production. So how production works is that a certain thing in your movie has to be a copyright. I don't know if this applies to all movie conducts, this is my own research of knowledge. So, I have teamed up with Scrunch, who, it's not confirmed, but if he's watching this video, then, this is, I messaged him on Discord, right, 
and he might be the sound and music designer for the film meaning that we're going to have official soundtrack now some of these are going to be copyrighted songs if used what i'm trying to say is that we are going to use songs that are copyrighted hopefully we will get the rights to them and if we don't unfortunately the movie has to get copyrighted now let's actually talk about its actual acting service so if you have watched my gorilla tag movies you know that the end of the credits you can see the player's name tag now this is going to be a full length feature film with actual serious production going on here and as we all know in films, that when a movie ends, there will be an end credit scene with real names. So, you're not going to see special effects made by Scrunch, or actor played as Popsicle123. You're going to see stuff like, I don't know, Bob McCurley as Paperbag Man. So, if you are a part of the My VR movie, right, if you are a part of the filming, now this will not be like the Gorilla Tag movies once again, like which every scene we switch out actors because we can't act out the full movie in like one day. We would have to be on schedule, meaning every time we had the chance to film, we had to film. No saying that, oh I'm at school and stuff like that, you are going home and getting on that VR headset and recording the movie as your life depended on it. Okay, that was a joke. If anyone goes to school and thinks they can do that, no, you cannot. If you do, you are a bad boy and you will not graduate. And I'm trying to at the moment. But anyway, so if you are a part, if we are going to be filming the Matty VR movie and you are a part of it, when we are done, you have to give me your full name and that's all i'm asking you your name not your ip address or your mother's credit card i'm talking about your name because my code is that if you don't put if we record the movie and then you randomly just say oh yeah sorry i can't tell you my name due to like privacy unfortunately you won't be in the film and we would have to re-record with other people or just literally kick you out the whole filming thing but as we all know that the movie clip i have showed in my 100 subscribers special was about me getting my watch modified for the guy who kidnapped the youtubers for me to know what room he was in or what room he used to be in now i thought that was a good premise right like a good reason for why my watch can like show a screen but I decided to change that because I felt like it was just not good in my opinion. I'm not going to say what we changed it for due to spoilers. But it's something different. And it's somewhat like a watch but it's a little more different. And obviously with it being a movie and we have to get custom maps made. Now some of the maps that will be used in films will be like other people's rooms because we are planning on like making different dimensions so different rooms will be used but also like our own rooms will be created i mean this movie doesn't have a budget but if it did we would have made way better sets than what we have now and also, we're going to add a lot of cameos and a bunch of references from, like, famous series such as Star Wars and, like, other things, right? But one thing that I can show for the My VR movie is the opening logos. Now, I can't show all of them, but I can only show one, and that is the Meta Movies, like, intro. And now... For my film, they're not meta movies, they're just Oculus. Just here's this here's the video.
if you know where I took that intro from, then you know. If you know, comment down below, and if you don't know, still like the video and subscribe, I guess. But now you're probably wondering, when is this movie actually coming out? Well, I can tell you, when I hit 100,000 subscribers, alright, you can all boo me, you can unsubscribe, but please don't. Now, the reason I want to make it special, right, it's because I have been on YouTube for about a year, I think, and I have not, <laughs> I mean, I'm not that big, I'm just saying that the way, if you want to see this film, then you got to work for it. <laughs> Help me hit 100,000 subscribers, get myself a play button, and you'll get the movie. My original thought that if I hit 100,000 subscribers, I would have released the film. And if I got 1 million, then I would have made a sequel. But that is very debatable if I would have made one or not. All I can say is that the movie is not in its filming era yet. We haven't actually started filming the film but if we have the chance we will start filming soon and if you want to be a part of it go over to my discord go over to the mighty vr movie channel where it has been updated all of that old stuff nah we got new and improved leaks about the film and even probably more things whatever i said in this video Thank you so much for watching the video, like, subscribe and slap that little bell to notify you every time I upload. And also, anytime you want to know about the My VR movie, go over to my Discord or even look at my oldest videos. Without further ado, I'll see you all in the next video boys. Bye bye everyone.